There really is nothing quite like getting out there and enjoying a day of boating with the family. I mean, everybody's all smiles, excited to be on the water, especially Dad. Welcome back, crew, to the greatest show on Earth, and that is the Miami Boat Ramps channel. I'm your host, Broncos Guru, and today we are down here visiting Boynton Beach. Let's see if this crew's going to jump into action and give Dad a hand as he tries to dock the boat, but they don't look overly thrilled about anything at this point. So Dad's going to make his move in. Gonna have to turn in toward this dock a little bit. And looks like we're gonna get a little bit of an assist. Somebody grabbed a boat hook. So he's just gonna have a hand of some kind as he comes in on approach. But he's kind of a little off on all the angles. I mean, he's trying to go to the dock right next to him here. So he's gonna back the stern up to try and get the boat to turn toward that dock. And it looks like we're finally ready for our approach. So, Cap, he's going to leave the helm. We've got the boat hook on the dock. He's got a line, but he can't get close enough. They've got to pull it in. And we're going to get a little rub action up at the front, but rubbing's boating, right? And they'll get it pulled over. So, Cap's coming in on approach. Looks okay right now. Good approach speed. Kind of starting to slide off the dock, though. You can see there he's got to turn the boat back to the port side to try and get it back over. And she's trying to get some lines attached right there to go for the grab. And she's going to reach out, gets a line around a cleat, pull it in, but now the bow's going to kick out because they've only got it attached to the stern. And Cap's going to leave the helm and going to have to try and pull it back over. I think the boat was still in gear. He just told her to put it into neutral, and I think that was part of the issue. But now they're able to get it pulled alongside. Anytime you guys see one of our camera guys out there on the water, go ahead and give them a Miami Boat Ramp shout out or feel free to interact with them, man. They love it. But if all I do is go you getting any of the drama here? You get down south? Yesterday, it was pretty good. Because <laughs> I watched something just the other day, Miami Boat Ramps, guy pulled back in, wouldn't let the guy out. Another guy takes his spot, another guy takes his spot, the cop comes down. Yes. Like, Yesterday, I hear the siren. I hear the siren over that way. I look. Boynton Beach Police is trying to pull over a little flats boat. Gotcha. They didn't pay any mind. They pulled all the way over in here. I had the camera rolling for like an hour. I can't believe they didn't get arrested. They were so obliterated and just yelling at the cop. He was such a nice guy. Wow. Small town. <laughs> Have a good day, guys. And our crew looks like they're ready to pull out. Then a few minutes of them trying to get it on the trailer. But I didn't notice them trim the motors up. So they're going to start pulling forward. Oh, one of those motors is on. The port side motor is still running. Here you can see the prop still engaging and going, even as he backs it back down. So not only did they not trim the motors, they forgot to turn one off. Fortunately, somebody caught it. As our guy backs the truck back down. So he's going to walk back over, and I'm assuming at least turn the motor off and possibly trim the motor back up. But man, that was a close call. Hey, I got, I got a good one coming. So here comes our crew coming back in on approach. They just left. 
what's called Beer Can Island over here, and it looks like some people have had a good day over there. Um, maybe this lady's had some snacks. I don't know. <laughs> That's a new one to me. But her friend on the back looks like she's had a little bit too much fun. So Cap's going to come back in on approach. Try and land this one. But <laughs> this crew definitely looks like they've had a good time over there at Beer Can today. So Cap's lining it back up again. I'm going to try and get her on the trailer. And we got another boat that's going to come in on them. I wonder who'll get it put up first, whether it be the guy or beer can crew who's been here for a few minutes already, or the guys that are coming in after him. Now, the guys who are coming in after him got a good line, good pace, and the race is on, and we're going to get a line onto the dock, and this crew will just line it up. <laughs> You're too good. We only post the crazies. Well, if he's getting close, we gotta be on there. I'll hit me both ramps. Don't post us. Post us. Don't listen to them. But of course, our crew makes it look easy. They're gonna get over here, put it up on the dock without any issue. I mean, we're going to post you guys, but come on, next time at least hit the dock or do something like that for us. So our crew is going to go over to the courtesy dock. Coming in with a heavy bow first approach. That's taking it easy as they approach the dock. But he's gonna come up from the front of the bow and grab the dock and they'll walk it over. Well done, ladies and gentlemen. Those guys are pros. Hey! 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 Oh no! Captain of the boat that dude, he just saw Doc over here. His shorts got hooked on one of the fishing pools and he winds up ripping his swimming trunks as he's getting off the boat. Oh, that stinks. Captain's walking away. He says he just bought them. So that's his first time wearing them out. And it'll be the only time he gets to wear them. But they've got the boat up and they'll be able to get out of here. And speaking of getting out of here, we're going to go ahead and get out of here as well. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Miami Boat Ramps. If you did, please check out our other content. We have Wavy Boats, who does a bunch of great things down at Hallover Inlet. My channel, Broncos Guru, do some great comedy boating videos there as well. And of course, we've got Boats vs. Hallover, where man and machine take on Mother Nature down at Hallover Inlet. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and drop an anchor on the subscribe button here.